welcome to the Sections Congress here in Sydney, Australia. We have Stefano Zanaro today We're from Italy section. So how are you finding Sections Congress this year? Uh, it's a very pleasant experience as usual, uh, meeting uh, IEEE volunteers and friends uh, from a long time. My first Sections Congress was 2008, so it's been a, like a family reunion. That's great to hear. We're really happy you're enjoying it. So, your area of expertise is security, right? What is your opinion about the current stage of security, especially, for example, in the area of Internet of Things? So, security is uh, uh, in Internet of Things, uh, well, there's a joke about it, and uh, which says that uh, the S in IoT stands for security, uh, which is basically not there. Um, we have a number of issues in there, both on the technical side, because uh, uh, in, in, for one reason or another, we seem to be running through the process again of developing things that are not secure and then trying to secure them, even if we have learned by now how to build things securely. And on the other side, which is actually even more important, we have the huge overarching problem of uh, how to guarantee privacy and how to guarantee that uh, data collection in IoT actually adheres to ethical standards. And I think that that's an area that the IEEE can do a lot for, uh, besides the technical research, uh, also on the standards for uh, ethics in development and design of these things. So, do you see the situation changing? Do you think people will start seeing security as more important than one of the basic things they have to take into consideration? I think that in one way, uh, I hope that having all these devices around them in all their daily activities will make people realize uh, much sooner that uh, security, safety, and privacy in these devices are actually important to their daily life. But on the other hand, uh, if you look at uh, uh, the evolution, for instance, of mobile applications, if uh, like uh, at Sections Congress 2008, we had the same interview, and I were asking you, would you actually carry around with you a GPS locator which is constantly on and constantly tracking your position? Most people will say no, never. And nowadays, instead, we are basically blindly doing that with our cell phones. So our perception of risks and safety and privacy has evolved with time. So we will see if people actually take care of the security of their devices. That's great to hear. Thank you very much. And stay tuned for more news from the Sections Congress.